Welcome to the BWB Flame Photometer Training Series. Today we will be looking at how to acquire readings from a multi-point calibration using the new BWB Auto Fluid Handling System, AFHS, and the BWB Bio Flame Photometer. The AFHS has been designed to automate the calibration and sampling workflow. Once calibrated, your AFHS can accommodate up to 89 samples. Upon changing batch numbers or the calibration correction fluid, a multi-point calibration for the ions of interest is required. This is an automated process using BWB AFHS. Subsequent regular single point calibration corrections can then be performed to keep the instrument at peak accuracy. Different calibration solutions are provided for serum and urine testing. For each type of test, the same solutions are used for sodium potassium and for lithium calcium, but with different dilutions. For a lithium calcium calibration, one further calibration solution is provided. A tray of calibration standards is prepared using the solutions provided. Calibration points 1 to 5 are placed at positions 1 to 5 in the carousel, with the extra solution provided for lithium and calcium placed at position 6. The auto diluter reservoir is filled with deionized water, or BWB cesium diluent, if internal reference is to be used. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will be using a right handed BWB bio flame photometer. The new generation of bio flame photometers will be unique as they have the chimney, nebulizer, and drip tray positioned to the left of the unit. This new design will make working with the AFHS a more efficient experience. Before a multi-point calibration, the instrument needs to be warmed up and in service mode. From the main menu, press Maintenance, Show Info, and enter your service code. Once you are in service mode, you are offered the option of testing for serum or urine. In this instance, we will select serum and sodium potassium ions. The option of setting up the calibration curves is then available. Select Calibrations, set up Calib Curves, and press Accept to begin the automated calibration process. The process takes approximately 20 minutes to complete. If a printer is available and has been activated, the reading for each point will be printed as completed. Calibration without AFHS is possible, but each point would need to be diluted and aspirated manually, and this would take a considerable amount of time. The AFHS initializes and positions the carousel for reference solution 1. The BWB bio will then flush the zero sample using fluid from the reservoir. Calibration of point 1 will then begin automatically using the solution in position 1 of the carousel. The BWB bio will take a reading once it has acquired a stable signal. Once the reading has been acquired, the AFHS will flush the sample using fluid from the reservoir and automatically position the carousel for the next reading. The process then repeats for calibration point 2 in position 2 of the carousel, and repeats three more times to acquire our third, fourth and fifth calibration points. Once all readings have been taken, the calibration process is complete and the AFHS is ready to begin automating your analysis. For more information on BWB flame photometers, head over to bwbtech.com where you can find more video tutorials, FAQs and a wealth of additional information. Thanks for watching and see you next time.